Welcome back everyone to the BD1P Iron Man streak. Today is going to be a Tainted Keeper run. For run number 108, an 8 out of 34 for our Iron Man challenge. Anyways, question of the day, put your answer in the comments down below is going to be, if you could see any band or artist, living or dead, live, in concert, who would it be and why? And I say that because uh, I went to a concert last night, but your seat is going to be 1DZYYA34. I went to a, a concert last night, my first one, uh, I guess since the pandemic was- Oh, please, let's go! Uh, was lifted. No, I missed- Oh, I missed that one, damn it. Three? Only three? Ooh, Tiny Planet as well. I love me some Tiny Planet, but I went to go see the band 100 Gex in concert. Uh, I know they are- they are a bit controversial when it comes to- to appreciating the music or hating it to death. Uh, I fall in the camp of I've always loved Gex, even when they were mostly hated. I was, a uh, Ooh, 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 okay, we have some stuff here, hold on. We need to get 30 cents on this floor, like, ASAP, for Pop plus Tiny Planet. It's a terrible, awful synergy, but it's very fun to have. Um, I've always been a huge fan of- of Gex, and I know they get a little bit of- of slack. Am I gonna die already? Nope, I am not, because I'm a god gamer. Uh, they get a little bit of slack, or flack, because, like, they have a very, uh, I don't want to say, like, outlandish, but they have a very abrasive sound to them. If you haven't listened to any Gex songs, I recommend, uh, Gek to You, 800 Decibel Cloud, and Bloodstains. Those are my, my top choices for their music, but, uh, yeah, the concert was amazing when they actually came on to play. I will say, there was a bit of an absurd wait to hear any music at all. Uh, so doors open at 7, and music started at 8. So we stood in the, the front of the barricade until like 8, or we stood there from like about, I don't know, 7, 10 to like 8, so like 50 minutes of standing about. And then their first opener, Alice Gas, came on, who was an amazing DJ for a DJ set. She was uh, really talented and very incredible, and I was, I was vibing to it, I was. Uh, and then... Alice finished around, I believe, like, 8.30, and then underscores their second opener, who wrote the, uh, critically acclaimed Fishmonger album from 2021, came on around, I wanna say, like, 9, so, like, another, like, half an hour wait between, uh, yes, we can buy both, uh, between the sets, which, it's fine, you know, they're openers, they aren't as professional as an actual band, like, you know, Gex, or a more professional-sounding, uh, you know, touring band, so underscores plays till about like 9.30 and then we wait like, no, so underscores finished at like 9. It was a long, I don't know, my time is fucked up. But anyways, it was a 45 minute wait between the second opener and the actual band to come on stage, which I, I don't mind too much if I wasn't like sandwiched uh, between... A, it's like the, it was a very tiny venue. It was, it's called, I don't want to, you know, dox myself, like I said last episode, but uh, it was actually a very, very, like, small... Uh-oh. Uh, no! Yes, we're fine. We're fine, gamers. Don't worry. The synergy is awful, but it's, it's so fun to have. Uh, it was a small venue. Maybe about, like, I don't know, 300 people there in total to, like, watch the show. And... Uh, we were all crowded in there. We were front. We were like right behind barricade. We were like front and center, or front and left side, pretty much. And the person behind me, like, kept elbowing me. And the person in front of us, actually on the barricade, was leaning over as far as they possibly could, and taking up the entire like like a three-person space, uh, right next to barricade. So we were pretty tight in there. And after the 45th minute of waiting. I said, like, hey, Daisy, let, let's go get some water. Let's go sit down somewhere because I don't know if they're going to come out in the next, like, you know, five minutes or 30 minutes. It might it might be a while. The second we leave barricade spot, the fucking show starts. I, I was pretty pissed off. I, w I was kind of like, are you joking? Like, are you, are you kidding? Nice, Penny, good. I want to get some early sacrifices for cash here. This synergy is so bad. Why did I take this? It's gonna be a fun one, though. Don't worry. I'm here. I'm here for a good time, you know? They stay in the air for a long time. That's a positive, right, guys? Please, uh, Swallowed Penny here. Yo, okay. That's maybe just as good for us. Black Market? Okay, hold on. Hold the phone. Give me some good eats here on the sacrifice room, please. I would love to see it. No, don't die to the ghost chest. You almost just did. Ghost, leave. Ghost, leave. Thank you. Okay. What can we do here to get more money? 
We can go into our crawl space and check that out first. If greed is in there, we might die because this build is kind of bad, but I'll take that chance. And we see glowing hourglass options. What an interesting uh, black market for us. Thank God they're fixed though, right? Yo, a nickel. Nice. Okay. We could buy one of these. Uh, if I had to pick one, I would probably choose Glowing Hourglass so we can, if we get hit in the room really badly, turn back time and get out. It also makes sacrificing a lot more viable on the run as well. So we'll go, like, for example, we'll go back in here. There's some money. Keep playing it. Keep playing it. Pop that open. Do that. Guardian Angel. Okay. Very, very nice. So now you walk out of there. You have full uh, health and you have great items. That was an amazing... Oh, and friend leash for Guardian Angel. Don't forget that. Very, very, very good first floor for us. Yeah, I mean, I would say the concert, it was it was worth it to go to it. Like, I had a good time. But the, the wait was just... It was almost too much to ask for... Like, I'm, okay, here's the thing. Is openers are great to have at concerts, right? It exposes the listener to more music in that same vein and helps small, like, small artists grow. It's a very positive thing for the community. That, that's, that's a given, at least, right? The only downside to having, you know, an opener is that people are usually there to watch the one artist, and they're not, they don't want to sit there and watch an opener. I will say, Gex opener is very, very good. Having two openers, though, on a band like Gex, who is not the most well-known thing in the world, it does kind of take away from the overall experience, I will say, and it just took way too long to get going, like... The wait was almost atrocious, but I, I would go again. I would go again, definitely. Um, I think they just got to work on their time management and stuff like that. I get it. It's a new venue. It's, you know, one of the uh, openers, like, first tours and stuff like that. It it's a hard adjustment to make. I understand that. But when you're putting on a live show, you can't really put those things at risk. So I just I hope that, you know, next time that guest goes on tour, they... Oh, this could be really good for us here. Hold on. How does How does you work? Yes, okay, beautiful. And we might as well grab this feather. That's going to be free angel items for us in sacrifice rooms. The build is getting better. The build is definitely getting better. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, I don't know. I enjoyed the show. Gex set was literally so fucking incredible. I was farther away at that point, but like I still had an amazing time watching them. They played some new stuff from their new album that sounded like it was going to be like straight up fucking classic hits. Why did using a pill crash my fucking game? Excuse me? Uh, Kilburn, fix that shit, please. I popped my right bumper and my entire game just crashed. That was strange. As the, the run's still here, five minutes in. Uh, we're back at the beginning of the floor, though, sadly. <sighs> well, you know, we might as well take our blind item now, and then if it's bad, hourglass back out of there. Might be the strat, no joke. <laughs> That's kind of lame, though. Like, come on. I mean, we, we, we did all our work for that. We didn't get hit at all. And, like, you know, I, I got an hourglass here, and that was the sad thing. So now I can't take my blind item and be happy with it. I gotta wait on this. Game, why do you gotta do it to me, man? I, I've been having a good day today so far, you know? I, I will say, uh, my big mistake last night, though, was I forgot to schedule my streak video to wake up, uh, like, to, to post before I wake up. And I had to log on to my computer at, like, midnight when I got back to turn on my computer just to upload streak number, like, 107. That kind of sucked because I was already extremely tired. I almost just died to a crash there. Cool. Uh, I was already extremely tired. I did not feel like I wanted to do that very well. But, you know, it's, it's part of the job, right? You got to be willing to make those, those sacrifices, I guess. But, oh my god, can you guys stop hitting me? I get it. I'm an easy target. I understand that. But please leave me alone. Nickel! Let's go! Okay. We are going to take our... Uh, don't pop that pill. It's a free crash for you, though, if you want it. Well, we'll buy this. It's bad. Get out of there. <laughs> Walk back in and go for number one. I guess that could have been part conjoined. Sure. Uh, but is that really worth it on this build? I don't think so. There's the feather for us as well. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Okay. What do I want to do on this run? 100%. Taking advantage of sacrifice rooms is, like, the way to go. Because we have the feather, it's free angel items, uh, two times every sacrifice room. If we can swing that money, at least. So, the earlier you find them, the better. 
Okay, keep dodging. You're dodging very, very well right now. Beautiful stuff. Ooh. There are two things that I really want in here. That being Ankh and um, Pyromaniac. But Deep Pockets, though. Okay, I want to use my, my one donation machine bomb on this run right here. Because I, what I want to do is pick up these two, get Deep Pockets, get some money back at, from that later on on the floor, and... I guess you want to buy Ankh first, so you don't die on this run. Because, uh, I mean, playing as Blue Baby, I did put him like the, like the worst character on my tier list, or most boring character. It's better than being dead on the streak, 100%. I will say that much. No coin drops there, very sad. We're going to be using our Hourglass right now, by the way, too, to farm for some money drops so we can actually afford the Ankh on the floor. Which we definitely can now if we get a penny here, yep. So we can now go back and buy the Ankh right away. And even if we die and lose quad shop, I mean, our build will be a little bit better still either way. So you go in, you buy Ankh, you walk out. Beautiful. And all you need now is 15 more cents for Pyromaniac, and you are sitting in probably the prettiest place for any streak run ever. So all you, all you need now is, like, bombs that'll heal you up for sacrifice rooms, and you are set. Wow, uh, Petrified Poop as well. That is really good to have for right now. We can break open every poop we already saw on this floor. And, um, get money back, potentially hearts and, and keys and bombs and such. Please. But yeah, I had a good time at the show last night. Uh, I think that a little bit more of, like, a streamlined or efficient setup would have been nice. Because I don't know what the big holdup was, to be honest with you. I don't know what it was. Because once the sound guys were done within 10 minutes of each set changing, there was, like, 40 minute wait. And I was like, what, what, what takes someone backstage, like... 40 minutes on top of their already, you know, like, timely openers to, to get on. I, I don't understand that. We can also walk in here, I guess. Um, get out of there, please. <laughs> Maybe don't walk in there is your first step. Beautiful stuff either way. Yeah, I don't know. I had a good time with it. Uh, I would go again. I just wish there was a little bit more of a, of a respect or a practice behind it, I guess. But like I said, Gex set was incredible. The new album sounds amazing already. I couldn't be happier with it. And we'll walk in now, I guess. Wild card is our free teleport out of this room if we need to. But it looks like so far, we do quite a bit of damage with this build. Because, I mean, our, our tiers stack up. Uh-oh. Hey, you're gonna live. You're gonna live. See, look at that, guys. I told you we're gonna live there. Even though I was a little scared for a minute. Okay. What's better for you? Pyromaniac, Guppy's Paw, or Cat of Ninetales? <sighs> you gotta go Pyro. It, it, it is the uh, sacrifice room way. It truly is. You might be asking yourself, BD1P, why the hell did you walk into that devil deal? I'll, I'll give you a reason for that. I'm a dumbass. I am a... Excuse me. Straight up dumbass. Uh, my thought process there was that we could find an item that would be better for us than anything in our shop, which is true. But we also have the feathers, so like... Angel rooms are the priority here, is what I'm trying to say there. Angel rooms are the priority. Uh, but the, I think the biggest issue with concerts for me is just having to get to them. Uh, no thank you! Please don't hit me here. You aim bot it, but you missed either way. Um, it's having to get to them. Like, I, I, I mentioned before on this streak that I am not the biggest fan of- Ooh! The biggest fan of driving, uh... I'm not like a bad driver. I, I've never, I've gotten in one accident before in my entire life and it was a very, very minor one. Like nobody got hurt and there was no damage to any car. Just to, you know what I'm gonna do here actually because there are two nickels right there. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna get in a little bit closer. Here. Okay, got one nickel and got two nickels. Beautiful floor. There's a third nickel but I missed it, damn it. Um, I, it's not that I'm a bad driver. I'm just very, very anxious behind the wheel. I just don't find myself comfortable in a driver's seat. Like, I, it's more like if I'm going to somewhere new or someplace busy, I don't like it. If I'm driving on the same route that I would drive to work every day, it's fine, man. Like, I, I grew up in a place where driving was, like, a necessity because I lived so far away from everything else. I couldn't walk anywhere. And it also being Wisconsin where the roads are constantly garbage. You know what? I'm going to buy that for Conjoin. The roads are constantly garbage there, so it's like you're never really uh, safe. But it's just driving to a big city scares me, and driving to any place new is what terrifies me. I just I, I can't get behind it, man. It just to me it's like 
I, I, I don't know the area, I, and that kind of unfamiliarity just kind of brings the whole thing down a level for me. I thought it was two moving boxes for a second, but it is definitely not. The box is, is also 100% a worth it buy for us, although we don't really have the means of, of buying it. No room there, okay, sure, sure, it's up here then for sure. Or, no, it can't be down, it can't, it's gotta be right there, beautiful. Uh, the reason why moving, or why regular box is so good is it can give you, like, a nickel back. It gives you a trinket, a bomb, and a key, and a card, and all that stuff. Although, I will say, we do have, like, a top-tier trinket, and a top-tier card, and a top-tier, like, everything right now. So, we don't really need the box, I guess. It wouldn't be terrible to have, you know, but we don't necessarily super need it right now. That's okay, we can move, we can go without it. I'm guessing you are right here, though, yeah? The more you know, dude. Okay. Pills. If the pills are bad, what we can do is just, uh, ooh, nice. Wow, nice. Um, the pills were okay. We, we could always just hourglass out of there, I guess. We're fine now. All right. It should be boss time here. Oh, get in there. I chose the right way. Let's go. Are we, ooh, watch out. Um, we, this run so far, even though our build is a little freaky with it, uh, I think this run is going to be a, a win. It, it, the hardest thing for us right now is hitting enemies like that who are stationary and uh, are in corners because our tiers do not f like like going in cor in corners it seems like, right which is uh kind of an issue when Isaac is centered around hiding in corners to cower. But hey, I think we'll be okay. Who's our boss here, huh? You you are gonna get messed up. We have a great built for little blub here. All we gotta do is sit in the corner, get some money for yourself. Don't worry about it. Oh my God, this build is actually decently very good. Get in there. Beautiful. No deal. Uh, we don't need to buy that at all. We may as well walk into our cursed room. If it's bad, we can hourglass out. Hopefully, I want to leave the cursed room with one HP. Then I want to walk into my boss trap room and see what the hell is going on in there. Let's uh, walk into here then real quick. I could go for moving back, like moving box strats with, um, be careful. Be careful. Get I need that really badly. Thank you. Um, we could go for moving box strats. What are you? Uh, and, and like go for like an R key maybe, but... Ooh, nice. I don't see that being, uh, extreme... Ooh. Extremely important for us right now. Okay, so you're gonna go with a golden pill here. Um, the reason being is that on a keeper run, using an R key is more of a detriment to you. Just because you're going back and doing... You, you can't get any more HP than two instead of like Mother's Kiss or something like that. So, they're... Ooh. Uh, will that be worth it for us? No, it will not. Get out of there. Uh, there really isn't a reason to doing that. Because if you can't go above two HP, you are equally, you know... At any point in the run, you can die, pretty much, what I'm trying to say there. Now, we have the Ankh. Very, very true. What are you? What are you? Uh, what, what's the card is my next question. Now, so what you want to do is you want to buy this, and then you can, um, hourglass out, get everything back to where you were. Perfect. I do kind of want a coin. Balls of Steel is nice. Perks is nice. Shot speed up. Explosive Diarrhea. Full health. Tears down. Amnesia. I can see, we already saw everything, so save your golden build for the next floor, hold on. Hmm, this is going to be an interesting one for us. We should have probably gone uh, mines with our glowing hourglass strats, but who really cares about that? We can uh, pop this. No more tears downs, though, please. Pretty flies good. That's bad. Bombs are key is great. And he just sucks. Speed up's really good. Diarrhea sucks. Uh, are you wizard is actually okay for us here. It's, uh, because we have a uh, freaking tiny planet, and it's finally gone. Okay, so I would say that golden pill was very good for us. We got a heal off of it, and we also got, um, a tears down, sadly, but pretty fly, speed up, all that kind of stuff is very, very helpful. And you might be worth it in the future, you never know. Grab that, grab that, grab that, and your last penny over here. Beautiful. I'm getting really good at diagonal walking in this game, I've realized. Rece in the recent years, I've, like, gotten super... I guess recent days. I've gotten super good at walking in between stuff, which is a very good skill to have in this game. Makes your dodging better as well, believe it or not. Also, our money right now is looking pretty rich. We could buy uh, our entire shop out this floor, potentially, if it's that good for us. What do I want to see? Piercing shots, homing shots, and, um... A oh, sacrifice room. Yo... 
No, don't pick those up yet. Don't pick those up yet. Okay, one penny here. One penny here, good. That is you feel blessed. You want to have enough to fight the angels. So get out of there for right now. Walk back out. You want to have enough there to fight the angels. So just make sure you clear the rest of your floor out right now. See what's going on in your item rooms and stuff. Infestation. That's really good for us right now. So there are two more pennies in the ground. So you walk in here, play that once. Walk all the way back out. Infestation means if we really wanted to, we could sacrifice down to dark room right now with a bunch of flies and carry that way. More money. Love to see it. Uh, that, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll indulge ourselves with golden bombs. Why not? Arrow walk. Okay. Walk out. There's troll bombs in there. All right. You got to be careful now because you are at, um, well, now you have full health again. Cool. So next one is the actual angel fight. I don't know if I feel comfortable fighting it on one heart normally. Wait. Wait, wait, hold on. Don't blow up on me, please. Okay, you're still there. No, we lost it because of... Oh, Curse of the Maze, why? Bring me back to there right now. I saved and quit there for a very certain reason. Uh, one of those being A, we could crash because this game is unbalanced. But B, uh, we keep the troll bombs there. We can use the troll bombs to kill the angel statue. Like so. Get him down. I'm going to arrow walk. Okay, beautiful. Get a penny out of this guy, maybe. Nice. All right. First angel is dead, and he gives us Destiny Spear. Okay. And what I want here is 20 cents. That's perfect. That is literally so good for us. Okay, your full health. Arrow Walk is still active, so stay back. You know, fight him normally here. You're fine. Get your tears. Get the waves out there. Beautiful. Never seen strats like this before, have you, gamers? Have you? Oh, get a, get a penny back. Stay on him. And our second item is going to be... Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho. oh baby. All right. Goddamn holy mantle. Uh, we should literally, like, literally never... Oh, we have... We could have been using golden bombs to heal that entire time, by the way. I am a fool. That is okay, though. I'm used to being a dumbass. So hold on. Walk in. Boom. I mean, either way, our, our run turned out to be extremely valuable off of that. Did we lose our, uh... Did we already use our freaking card? Our... Our Uno reverse card? Wild card thing? Uh oh You know what? Do that over again. I want to fight that right now. Get, just go, go in fast and you should be fine. You shouldn't be... I, I got hit way too much in this room right here. Way too much. Okay, that was way better for you. And a greed fight. All right. I mean... We can deal with this, I guess. We're fine. Just, just, just honestly buff it all the way out. Steam sale. Greed was very good for us. What I'd love to see in this run right now would be member card. That could be insane. Any kind of more sacrifice rooms as well, I would, I would, I, I would die to see those, honestly. Because sacrifice rooms, again, equal free angel items for us. I can't pop any pills. They'll just crash me at this point. Huh. I mean, I'll, I mean, I'll bomb all of you. You have golden bombs for a reason, right? The 315. We're also at above 100 cents. Money equals power would be great to see here. I mean, literally anything money-oriented right now would be crazy. I would even take golden razor on this run. Because we have a lot we can... Uh, oh, don't, don't get hit here. You're, you're better than this. You're playing too risky. Calm down. Holy Mantle is not an excuse to get rough. It's an excuse to play safer. It's a reason to play safer. I say that Russian out chub right there. Lose it immediately as well. Beautiful. Get in there. You have golden bombs. You're going to beat Hush super easily here. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Four cents. Five cents. Angel deal gives us... Whew. Uh, I'm going to go with this because we have Holy Mantle for right now. I'm going to bomb you and I'm going to destroy you. Absolutely. Oh, you're not slow anymore. Good for you. Good for you. Okay, good. Get a bomb in there. Get another one in there. You missed that bomb, sadly. Yeah, good shit. Just don't get hit, please. You want to keep your Pascal Candle alive for as long as humanly possible. And you're dead. And you give me Trinity Shield. We have to have the Sword, the Shield, and the uh, other Holy Mantle Shield. Okay. And they're all piss yellow. Amazing. Get that for two keys, I guess, and a luck upgrade. Be beautiful. Okay, so we're going to have a very fast tier right now because Pascal Candle is... One of its things is known for is being able to break the tier cap. And because we have Holy Mantle... 
you won't ever lose your Pascal Flame. The way it works, if you get hit in a room, you lose your Flame, but it starts, it starts over from zero. You go from having like plus five tiers to plus zero tiers. But now that we really can't be hit very often, plus we have Glowing Hourglass in case we do get hit, we're gonna have an extremely stacked run going on here. Extremely stacked. Nope, no drop. I guess this just flies for us, sure. Uh, the other thing is too, while having Pyromaniac, it also allows us to, uh oh please, um, it also allows us to take bombs to the face with no repercussions. We can stand as close as we want to any explosion and be fine. And you can see right now that our tier rate is uh, a little crazy. I mean, watch us just kill this boss like, instantly here. I mean, come on, like you don't you don't compete with that kind of shit, right? Like you have 120 cents and you're doing great. What do I want more of? Again, sacrifice rooms, angel deals, uh, the lot, everything. We also have, might I add, another defensive item in the form of Trinity Shield, allowing us to stand in front of shooting enemies and block them outright. The only better thing than that for us right now would be Divine Intervention, which would push enemies back into our wall of tears from directly in front of us. These golden pennies have sucked recently, man. That's kind of awful. Out of here, out of here. There we go. Don't get hit, you're fine, you're better than this. Don't get hit here. Back it up, beautiful stop. I think our Pasco Flame is now capped out at 3.65. Uh, the only other way to increase it now is through Cancer or Anti-Grav, I'm pretty sure. Or maybe like Bar of Soap or... No, Eye Drops or Bookworm also helps increase your tiers a little bit. What I would want now is any kind of shot multiplier too. Give me 2020. Give me Inner Eye right now. Give me... Conjoined will be so good for us on this run. Remember, we still have base damage. Uh, we have had no damage ups in the entire run right now. So we are kind of running on empty when it comes to actual DPS. So right now, Conjoined will be fine because we don't have any damage to really lose a ton of. And since it is procedurally lost through like percentage values, so we're going to be killing it on this run. Yeah, going back to the previous tangent, though, I have... You have to, you have, you have Pyromaniac. You have to do this. Look at our, look at our shit now. Oh my god, okay. Uh, I'm not a bad driver. I would say out of, uh, my family, uh, I'm a better driver than my sister. Uh, I, I don't know anymore. I haven't talked to her in a while, but I'm assuming I'm still a better driver than her because she's a little bit spacey sometimes. But, like, I'm not a, I, I don't think I'm a bad driver, genuinely. I think I am an okay driver. It's just, I just don't like driving. That's my biggest issue. There you go, buddy. Nice. Alright, big shop. Another greed fight. We, we can do another greed fight for us. Look, look, I mean, look at this build, right? We can manage anything right now. And what is this judgment card going to be used for for us? Well, I'll tell you, dear viewer. We're going to use this uh, if we find a secret room with some kind of, like, like machine in it. Or an item room with a reroll machine in it. Anything that has a reroll machine or a reroll capability. Whether it be a shop, item room, or secret room. That's what I'm going to use. Uh, I don't see a reason to use it now. Just because, uh... All it's going to be is a health upgrade for us. We don't really need any health upgrades, to be honest with you. We're kind of fine. Size down is not bad. No crashing pills, though. It's not the crashing pill. I'm not going to risk it, though, either way. We could go Mausoleum. This is true. In fact, I genuinely do want to go Mausoleum right now. So why don't we? Wow, it takes your mantle and your coin heart, huh? For shame. Ooh, don't walk into anything here, though. Luckily, too, Holy Mantle got another buff. It is now a uh, whole one second invincibility frame, as opposed to the old half a second. So, as you can see right there, it lasted forever. On a normal run, I would have been dead right there, 100%. But now we get uh, Downpour Access, which I will just go ahead and go into right now, because we have Holy Mantle. All right, we get an extra item room here, I believe, and... Um, an extra shop as well on these next two floors. Very, very, very good for us here. Oh god, um, okay, well. You're blue baby now. You are now blue baby. That room sucked. I didn't get a penny there, and there was so much blood on the ground. Uh, that was bad. That was bad. Well, well, well. I mean, blue baby is not bad to be. We get more HP now. We still have deep pockets for our shops and judgment cards and all that. We can make the most out of this run right now. Speaking of making the most out of this run, it's not that. Get out of there. Walk back in. You're taking a Nima Sola. You're ditching the Hourglass Tracks. It's not worth it anymore. You lost Tainted Keeper. You don't need it anymore. You're fine. Ow. Some of these rooms, man, occasionally, they get to you. But I will say, right now, Fire Mind, Pop, Tiny Planet, this build is still 
crazy as hell. What happened there? I don't even know what happened there. My bomb's like, oh, beautiful. Tears up or damage. It's even better for us. But yeah, the benefit now is we have more tears because we do have the, uh, watch out. You do have, um, Pascal Flame still ignited here. And you have no more, um, quad shot. Which means you get a definite, definite increase on that front. We also have a judgment card that might honestly use for HP. Uh, the feather still exists for us. Watch out, please. Okay, good. Kill that guy last. You have the feather still, so you could do some sacrificing here. You never, you never know. Eternal chest is going to be very good. Please pay out in a nice way. Nah. We got keys back. Who cares? And you. Verp a hematemesis, which is nothing for us. Okay, amazing. But yeah, I, I think I'm a good driver. Uh... Most of the people that I know in my life, my friends and such, like from high school and shit, they got into like a couple accidents occasionally, and I would consider those people to be, you know, good drivers. So, I think I just don't have this, I, I don't know if it's experience or if it's just like, you know, anxiety or whatever it is, I just, I just can't, you know, I, I can't do driving that well. Uh, in my brain, it, just, it gets me nervous, I get, I get anxious and I get a little uh, crabby as well, so... Whenever I have the opportunity to, just, to, like, you know, go somewhere far, I will generally take a train or a subway, something like that over driving any day. It also could be, you know, economically, why did I, why did I do that? I, I know how this room works. What is wrong with you? I'm not Tainted Keeper anymore. You gotta play a little bit safer than this, you know? That, that death in that room really hurt. I should have instantly hourglassed there, but I was not, you know, really paying attention that much. Okay. Go in. Ah, uh, you can't anima sola yet. All right, now kill them all. You're gonna be so fine on this fight. You get one sole in there. Like, watch this shit. Kill the last guy over here. Freeze him. Stand right next to him. You're doing uh no. Oh, he was in his fr eye frame still. Of course he was. Why did I think about that, huh? Well, here's a charging attack. You're, oh, why are you still going up right there? What the hell was that attack? All right, safe. Oh, hold on. Oh, you still do that, huh? Okay, hold on. We're gonna focus here for a second. We're working at angles of five, and we're cool. Okay. You get eye drops here? Or, uh, yeah, no, a tropa side. Yeah, great. Oh. Well. Fancy, uh, seeing you here. I will take you. Um. And I will, I will walk on out of here. Okay. So now we have Judas' Shadow. That is a two damage multiplying item when we die. I'm not going to, again, force my death here. I really want to use it on a sacrifice room. Again, the, the failing green feather, the, the fall, fall, failing green feather, whatever you want to call it. I don't know what the trinket, trinket's actual name is, but whatever you want to call this trinket. If we can use our, our, our spare HP on a sacrifice room. Oh, our shops are still good too, apparently. Okay. Actually. Uh, now is your best time to die. Send to me, dude. Oh, don't break the fires, though. Is that gonna break the fire? It is not. What? What? Does Pyromaniac make you immune to fires now? Did it always do that? Uh, we literally cannot die on this floor, then, can we? I wanna... Oh, wait. We totally can. Okay, so you die right there. Respawn. Uh, eight damage now. Good enough for me. You walk in, you buy the HP upgrade, you pay this guy out, you also buy like everything you can in here, because even bum friend is going to be nice for you on the run, because you have so much money right now. Bum friend will be a positive for you, trust me. Buy bum friend. Uh, I don't know what that pill is. I'm going to buy this as well, and I'll buy the pill. It's a really big vert pill. I'll wait on that one for sure. And you give me mapping, that's fine. This was Lovers, this is Temperance, we'll pop that down right here and blow all of this up. Grab the Vert Pill for yourself. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I feel pretty good about the run still. There definitely could still be a sacrifice room on this floor. Whether it's worth it or not is the new question. Also, buy, take all the money for me, man. I don't need any more money on this run. Now, that could be interesting. That could make our sacrifice room, if we have one... Uh, really, really good for us. Also, Spider Mod is so good for health bars right now. Okay, good for that. Uh, pay him out. 
Pay, the, pay, pay this guy out too. He's gonna drop some money for bum friend here. Take a bump. It's all you, bum friend. All you, dog. You deserve it all. More money for you. You gonna drop anything yet? Either of you? I guess not. More bombs. Okay, half red heart. Now, I don't really need any red hearts right now, man, but we're, we're cool with that, I guess. We'll do this. We'll walk in to use some more. Any kind of reward here. Any kind of bomb. Hey, we have Nancy bombs now. That's pretty nice. Stars card, sun card. That's interesting to see. And what's over here? No sacrifice room. That is that is very, very sad. I, what I could have done is uh, use the big burp to get a pill back and had another health upgrade on the floor, but that's okay, man. That, that's all right. Left hand, huh? Um, you know, no thank you on either of those. We... I'd rather have the feather in case we do encounter more angel statues somehow. Uh, I don't. I think we're too late into the run to hematomesis. hematomesis to um really manage Guppy or making that worth it with our current HP situation. We'll just start bombing open rooms here and seeing what gives. Oh, that's, that's that's for you. I'm so sorry, man. That's all for you. Nothing great there, and we'll just uh, move on then, I guess. You can still find statues in your super secret rooms and stuff like that. So, don't ever skip out on those. You can find them in a lot of places. Why are our bombs... Oh, I guess Nancy bombs gives you golden bombs occasionally. Interesting. I'm going to play a little bit safer right now, because our build is still a little bit on the edge. It, it's probably right here, yeah? It is right here, okay. Ooh, okay. Um... You down there did not pay out yet. I'll give you... Well, no, I'll save my bombs. We're cool. Let us just move on. Anima Sole is good for any boss fight, obviously, because we have fire mines. Keeping a boss on one of those fires would be huge for us. Aside from that, I feel pretty okay. We also have mapping now. I remember just, just, like, just at this moment, we do have mapping now, which... Uh, it's going to make the, the womb floors and things like that easy to manage or easier to manage. We're only going to have one womb floor now. So we have the uh, the dang old... Um, oh, these are all for you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. We're going to hit a lot here. Oh, my God. Stay, stay frosty. Does that ruin our build? Oh, it does not. It actually looks, like, pretty sick now. I'm not gonna lie. I fuck with this a lot. Kind of. It's really hard to aim now. <laughs> this might be my weirdest build in this game in forever. But we do on the bright side have piercing shots now. So these current top tiers will uh, never go away. Until they run on a range, obviously. But this, this is gonna be pretty interesting for us. Uh, what is the puzzle here, huh? Okay. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Let me out of there, please. What are you... Like that? That's not, even a, that's not even a puzzle at all, dude. Okay, health, please. Of course. Um, oh, now I... Okay, now I get it. Now I get it. Oh, what, what do you even do about this? Well, I know you can do. You can do one of these right here. Uh, it's called a save and exit, and you can leave the room for free. Look how efficient we are, chat. Okay, we gotta focus on this run right now because right, I don't, I don't know what the hell our build is, but it uh, it's kind of scaring me. It's kind of scaring me just a little bit. Here. Those are for you, bum friend. I'm sorry. I will never learn to leave money on the ground for that man. I am way too selfish with this build, or with with any kind of money in this game. Okay. Uh, so you do want to buy this? And pop it down. And then that's for bum friend to have. And then restock your shop and just buy everything you can right now. Literally everything. Even the HP is going to be very helpful for you. Sun card, stars. Okay, mom's key. Nice. Fanny pack, huge for us. Hill is x lax nothing great. Buy the sacks too, why not? And get more money for bum friend, you know? You know how it is. And we have smelter now, okay. We're getting into the good things it looks like right now. We have smelted the feather now, which means we can't get any more Mega Satan fights. Sorry, chat. 
Uh, that's blue map. Might as well buy the Vent Razor for whatever reason. You have the money for it, I guess. And then now you get... Coupon. And a battery pack. Both of which are, like, extremely not worth it for you right now. Um, that was great. You have almost natural 10 luck, by the way. Stars is not great for us. Okay, let's do some more exploring right now and just see where the world takes us. We have, we have Nancy bombs. We have tons of things we can work with right now. Again, I would not mind a sacrifice room with our current build. We could live a couple sacks there and get some more, you know, seven soul hearts out of it. You never know, man. We'll do this. No more money for us. Now, Bump Friend's biggest thing is that he can drop us Crack Die, which could roll every item in that shop into even more shop items. He could also drop us a Reverse Judgment card. Now, hold on. Don't break that. Don't break that. Thank you. Just spiders, huh? Watch out. Okay, it worked. Beautiful. You know what? I'll take it. We'll see what happens here. Alexa has told me this item is, and it is pretty good. It's actually pretty slept on. And I have to agree right now. Look, look at this build. Like, Cursed Eye, Technology, Pop, Tiny Planet. I mean, in a boss fight, because of how many tiers we're going to have on the screen, we might be able to crash our game naturally here. Look at it real, real, you know, closely there, Popeyes. Extra card? Hermit. Man. I just want to have, you know, there's no sacrifice room on this floor right now, which really irks me. Nice dodge. Beautiful. Uh, I, I think what our, our power is going to come from right now is fighting bosses. I mean, this build against a, a, a frozen enemy is going to shred. Also, that's amazing. That is straight up incredible for us right now. Because we know where everything is on the floor. We can generally see where our boss fight, sorry, bomb fight, is going to be, as well as, like, everything else. Emperor card is a, a nice, quick passage to the Beyond Realm. Here's in there. Walk him in. Beautiful. So good for you. Okay. Negative or, po go Polaroid. We went negative the last, like, three runs, I think. Okay. Down to Womb 2 here. Is this floor going to be too big to want to clear? This is a very fast floor, it looks like. I'm going to go left. If it's not left, I will just Emperor card. Simply. Because I see our super secret over there. I'm guessing the boss fight is actually down. But on the off chance that it is to our left, we're going to have a very fast floor here. Bum friends, all you, dog. All you, baby. What you got for me? Ooh. Okay. Okay. I, I see what you're trying to do to me here. I respect it. Uh, should we go into that room? Might as well bomb in there and see what's going on. We could also Emperor card out if we don't want to fight the actual boss fight here. That's worth it for sure. That's worth it. Who do we got first here? Freeze him. Oh, unfreeze him, please. Uh-oh. Get in there. Get in there. You're beautiful. You are so good at this game sometimes. Okay, freeze the cage. And you're going down. I mean, yeah, we do a, we do quite a bit of damage here. This run should be as, as close to a free win as we can possibly get on this trick. Oh, a golden troll bomb. Everybody's favorite. Get all these, these, these coins over here, bum friend. Okay, what's going on with you? Bomb, heart, that's it. All right, I'm, I'm cool with that. We'll go to our left and go to our super secret room for an angel statue, potentially. If not, we should look for sacrifice rooms though on all of our dead ends either way. It's a, not a sack, but a curse room. Still helpful to see. We'll walk in for sure. Not worth <laughs> at all. Is our boss fight right here? It is not. And neither is our super secret room. So we have one more place to check for the, uh, the sack room. Which is uh, up in both of our little like areas over there. Our quadrants. And if again, if it isn't there. I mean, there is only one final chance for a sacrifice room. And it's probably not the highest or most reliable way to get one. So we'll just move on from that. We might as well just Emperor card next floor instead at that point then, because we've already cleared out most of the womb right now. There's a Vault Room, though. Could be helpful for us. Watch out. Could be very helpful for us. Bum friend? Go wild, man. Go wild. Come on, drop, drop me uh, another Emperor card. Something crazy on the ground right now. Wow. 
uh, troll bombs and a range up pill. Okay, you know what, buddy? You made that all worth it for me. All right, just, just do your floor normally here. That is a free devil deal, actually. Never turn that down. That is a completely free deal. Uh, so pick that up, get over that, and go to your boss fight now. This is going to be the freest fight of your life as well. So is mom's heart going to be hard? No. <laughs> Has any fight of the room been hard yet? I don't think so. Uh, mom's heart will be a, a simple space bar press and then like literally just standing there with my, my shield out. So I don't see mom's heart being hard. I don't see Isaac being hard. I don't see Blue Baby being hard. I don't even see Delirium being hard at this point. So this run is, is, a, is a one run. Stop watching if you want to now at this point. But if you're here for me, I appreciate that. Yeah, it, it's been a, a, a nice a nice day today. I woke up. Sorry, bum friend. Again, I made a mistake. I, I went, uh, I showered, I recorded my tier list video that came out yesterday, all my character tier list stuff, and then after that, um, I just made some thumbnails, I ate some cinnamon rolls, and I went for a quick walk with Desi, and that was that, and now I'm here recording Isaac, which is, uh, never a bad thing. I really enjoy this streak, I've realized. Oh, hey, you can't do that. I'm really enjoying this streak right now. I'll be honest with you guys, like... Oh, I haven't enjoyed an Isaac streak this long. Oh, uh, that's, that's okay, I guess. That's fine. I haven't, like, actually enjoyed a streak like this in God knows how long. I I've had a really, really good time with this, and I think it shows in my uh, my excitement about every episode here, because I've, I've really enjoyed, like, just getting weird, wacky, crazy, even, like, terrible synergies. I've, I've had, like, a... Ah, that sucks. A really, really good time just playing out the entire run here. So thank you all for sticking around for the actual streak. I, I've, you guys have made it a joy, a, a true and, and unabashful joy. I, I think every run I play on this streak, every character I touch is always a new adventure. And you guys are always here to watch it, so I do appreciate that. Especially when we move into the different stuff on the streak here. Like when we finish up this Iron Man, which hopefully I'll win the Iron Man. I've kind of played through all of the hard characters so far. I feel like, um, and gotten done with them. Like, once I'm done with a full-on Iron Man here, I guess we'll just do some, like, some greed mode stuff, some modded stuff, some co-op stuff. It's just a random assortment of, like, fun, different ways to play Isaac. And you guys, I know, you'll all be here for that anyway, so I appreciate that. It's nice having that security of knowing that everybody is actually going to stay here to watch this streak. So, pat yourselves in the back for that one. I see a lot of potential sacrifice rooms on this floor. I think the one above us is the, the best chance for one. So I'm going to do a full clear here. We will use our um, Emperor card on the blue baby fight. That'll be the, the best bet, I think. We can spam fire. We can spam fire really fast as realized. We don't really need those. What's in here? Uh, If we find a sacrifice room, those soul hearts will be worth it, I guess. We'll see, though. Woo, a dime? You're spoiling me, game. Bum friend, get over here, man. It's all you. Two bum friends? My worst nightmare. Will that give you super bum if you get three bum friends on one room? Can that, like, actually give you super bum? That'd be... Okay, so fire does not hurt us anymore. Did Pyro just, like, just recently do that? Or was that always a thing Pyro did? I've never noticed... In my 3,000 hours of this game, I have never noticed that. Ever. Uh, get a holy mantle back when you walk into that room. Yeah, beautiful. What's going on? Hell yeah, man. Sure. Nancy Bombs, Curse of Power. Amazing for me. I don't care. I will do anything. I oh, we have a sacrifice room. Okay. This is where boys be... Oh. What do you got for me? The crashing pill. Amazing. Um, this is where boys become men. You still... Oh, I'm immune to bombs. Don't worry. I'm immune to bombs. Don't worry. Polaroid, though, is annoying. Uh... One by one, I guess. One by one. Okay, there's a hit right there. Walk out. We're gonna be at pretty low HP here. Uh, but trust me, I think it will all be worth it. I, I will bet money on us getting the seven soul heart bet at the end of the sacrifice room. I will put literal money on that. Or just finding holy shit that. Um, you have to pop that, right? Like, you can't not pop that. That is Genesis for you. I mean, if you turn that down, you are a straight-up coward. I'm gonna pop that next floor for sure. I will. 
So next will be our angel statue fight. So watch this. You walk in. You get hit. You kill him, like, extremely fast. You get... Oh, this might be a crazy build. Hold on. Can we get prism on any of these shots? Oh, you totally can. Okay, amazing. There's our seven soul hearts as well. Ay, 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 dude. Okay. One more angel fight for us here. Goodbye. Look at our build right now. Holy shit, dude. And another respawn item. We went from Tana Keeper to Blue Baby to Dark Judas to Laz 2. Ay, 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 man. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I guess you just go and you, uh... Emperor card now? Finish out your floor? How do you lose this kind of build right here? Look at this kind... Oh, that's how you lose. Cursed Eye, right. That's how you lose the run, huh? Cursed Eye? Okay, well, just be careful. You'll be fine. I mean... If that, it took us that long to realize that Cursed Eye is a downside on this run, that it's not going to be that applicable for us. We're going to be super okay. Just keep doing what you're doing, man. Just, just walk in. Get some, some Curse of Tower bombs down there. Stay frosty. Holy Mantle is still up. Drag some tears into good old Isaac here. Go hide, go hide, go hide. Oh, you hit me there. Okay. Cool. No, that's, that's, that's fine, man. I don't even care. I do not even care. Charge all the way. And go down. Charge it up. Hold in. Hold in. Oh, he's dead. Let's go. Okay. Next floor is going to be big for us. We have the chance to uh, do something here, I guess. What items do you want to have? Ooh, I want to keep C-section really, really badly. So, the rest of these can go. I'm going to pick this up again. Pick this up again. And get this as well do this and we're now black judas uh piercing i'm gonna go meager mycosis here i will go cube baby squeezy thank you Ooh, mystery gift for sure oh i mean tr try saggy on 100 percent um we'll go i don't want either of those other ones uh we'll go for conjoin sure damage and hp Tears up. Um, good pills, I guess. Conjoint. Uh, infinite lives. <laughs> yeah, Isaac's heart. Why not, man? Sure. Red stew. We should have gone for the other one there. Yeah, you guys are right. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Leave me alone. Um, we have good pills. So we'll take you. Lead pencil for sure. Immaculate Heart for sure. Ooh, that's a hard one. Uh, I'm going to go Protection Circle here. Eventual Spirit. Aquarius. 4.5. Ooh, that's for sure going to be taken here. Uh, Halo. That's damage and speed. That is Spirit Sword. So I respect a lot as an item. That's really good to Spirit Sword. Yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Looks like a magic skin for sure here. Uh, you? I guess you. Um, I guess you. Woo. Ay, 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 these items here, man. These items, what are you? Algis? Not really worth it for me. Sure. Uh, health up, sure. Tears up, sure. Don't pick up D6. Do not pick up D6. Go stopwatch. Go twisted pair. You're also conjoined now. I'll go for brimstone bombs. Why not? Money equals power. But, but this is a game break almost right there for tears. Damage up. And damage up. Um, Wafer, of course. We'll go to Vinyl Intervention. Why not? Explosion Immunity is back. Stairway could be fun if we ever get it to work. And you give me that. I'll pop that. Makes you larger. We'll become big boys. Who cares? Pick up that, too. What's up? We'll go... Algis. So I took magic skin for a reason here. 
That is also really good for us. Oh, this is going to be one hell of a run, boys. Save and quit. You don't want to crash the game and lose all of your Genesis progress right there. Save and quit. That's why you save and quit, because that crashes your game, like, instantly. Uh, we are going to be using a strategy for getting an Arky here called uh, Killing Yourself with Magic Skin. It is a patented BD1 P strategy. Uh, don't worry, I've tested it out before and it works very well. I've died before using it, but we're gonna ignore those those times. Shoot once and you're fine. Get out of the room before it crashes again. Beautiful. Okay. Sack of sacks. I guess you're not what I needed. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. You're dead. Fruit cake, huh? That's gonna maybe also crash our game. That might actually also... Oh, that's a nice trinket to see. Also crash our game. Uh, we're probably not going to see an Arky. Hmm. But if we do, I'll feel like a smart man for all of this. We have 4.5 volts. Interesting. We might actually get to see one. Uh, we can actually do... I'm, I might do a little bit of cheese here to keep this run going on longer. That cheese being this. I, w I want to find a good room to use the cheese in. I guess we can't do it on this run. Though. So we don't have a uh, a bomb. We could get a charge every single room if we really wanted to. If we save and quit the game while it's charging, I'll make it. I'll do an example here, right? You shoot. Okay, now you exit the game. You restart. Your charge will still be there, and you'll uh, be able to kill every enemy once over again. Or you can crash your game like I just did there. Look, we saved though pretty good uh i will say this patch is a bit crashy i've had more crashes in the past like two days than i have ever before in isaac even though crashes were pretty common in, in earlier patents builds i've had more crashes nowadays than i have recently just start shooting once only your guys home in and they're sticky tears so why wouldn't you nose goblin's pretty fun but so is crystal key i mean dude if we get an arky here i will be ecstatic like, I will be a happy, happy man. Dad's ring, not an Arky. Lusty blood is damn near good, though. Damn near good. Shoot once. It's just that easy. It is just that easy. Plus, because uh, all the rooms here are full of bosses, you get definitely more than one charge worth on every room. Making, um... you calm down? Making your... What are you guys doing over there? Relax. Making your 4.5 volt that much more worth it for you. So we're going to get a lot of pops in these rooms. Let's make sure. Oh, pick up that for sure. I mean, might as well grab. I Don't grab. You could find D100 on this floor. You could find a bunch of dice items. So don't grab all of them. But grab the one up in case you want to respawn with uh, using all of your magic skin charges. Chariot card? Okay. Okay. I, I see that. I see that working for us a little bit here. Isaac, come on, man. <laughs> You can't do shit in this game anymore without the game crashing on you. I get my build is a bit taxing, but like, if my PC can handle it, why can't the game? It might be a dumb question to ask. I have a lot, I have a lot of like game devs in my view my viewership, so oh great, this room again. Um, might be a dumb question to ask. I don't, I don't know, you know, memory overloading and stuff like that. But I mean, still, like, come on, come on. There's got to be a better way to handle this, right? Like. Oh, what is that rune? We didn't see that. that was, that's a new one for us. Also, what the fuck is all of that? Oh my god, the crash worked out so well for us. Save and quit right here. Um, okay. I would say we might be guaranteed to get an Arky here. 100%. Bad's ring, right? That being because we have so many Soul of Isaacs over there. Uh, and also Souls of Eden, weirdly enough. If you just do that... Why did I get hit there? What? And leave the room and come back? Uh, don't crash on me, please. You know what? I kind of want to save and exit once more again already. You shoot. Thank you. Leave the room. Fast, fast, fast. Go. Thank you. Uh, we can essentially turn, like, pick up that for sure. T take the one up always. Um, you can essentially turn everything in there into, like, a, a really, really, really good reroll situation for you. So maybe that crash was actually a positive thing. Please leave. Again, make sure you're saving quitting like every single room. Because if your game crashes, you are freaked. You are done. You're, you're over. 
absolutely done. Okay, get out of there. Quickly, please. Don't don't ever linger in a room like that. Hierophant? Thank you, game. I needed that really badly. Okay. Saving quick, continue. This is how game breaks work, man. And if we do this run as an Arky over again, we're going to be back in another place. We're going to be using uh, quite a bit of, of saving and quitting and having quite a bit of broken hearts on us to make confessionals really, really worth it for us. Okay. Skeleton key is cool to see, I guess. Continue on, save and quit again. I know it's a bit of a long process here, but just bear with me, bear with me. Once we get the ball rolling on actually R keying and starting over, it'll be a quicker run again. So if you want to, if, if we get the R key on this run, skip ahead to that point and see what happens. Kill, kill. Out of the room, please. Out of the room, please. Out of the room, please. Uh, thank you. Judgment? Nah. It could have been, oh, part guppy for us, though. Or two parts guppy now, I think. Uh, we're fully charged, so again, walk all the way back. I don't know how doubling up on Soul of Isaac actually works. I mean, we'll be seeing different items every time, obviously. Forget Me Now is an interesting one as well. We're getting to a point on the run where I don't want to be doing much more of the rooms because I'm at two hearts only. We do have one up plus Guppy's Collar. That is a very safe respawn option for us. But, um, do I really want to be in that position? Oh, no, 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 no. Kill her first. Or wait. It didn't matter. We could have got nine lives there either way. Okay. Again, save and quit. Go fight Blue Baby. Keep your progress going here. One shot should end her. Or end him, I guess. Yeah, you're gonna be good. Holy shit, you're getting fucked up. Okay. Uh, leave, 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 leave. I could risk the other... I'm, I'm gonna pop it. We don't have Holy Mantle anymore. But we have the respawns, and the respawns make me confident to pop it one more time in here. Uh. Or not. We respawn, though. Uh, now it's time to Soul of Isaac, I think. Well, there it is. <laughs> There's actually both of them that we wanted. Um, huh, interesting. We already saw... If we only we would have taken school bag, man, we could have had two R keys again. Well, here's what I'm going to do. We have a guaranteed R key sitting in here. So I'm going to use this first. And... What's a fun item to pick up right now? What a weird starting room. Holy shit. Uh, what do we need a lot of? It wouldn't be bad to have heartbreak right now, but we literally have the option to pick up anything in the game. Am I really going to go with heartbreak? Am I really going to go with heartbreak? We can do some walking around. Another Judas's shadow wouldn't be bad. Um... Actually, let's think for a minute here. If we took Diplopia and doubled our R key over there, we still would need to have school bag to make that work, wouldn't we? Hmm. I'm trying to think how we can get school bag and then carry both, like, death cert, a death cert and a, uh, Anything down to the next floor with us? So if we got school bag right now, we could take Arky and D Infinity, which uh, could lead to some very interesting things. I don't know. This is the first. Actually, you know what I want to take is um, Red Key. I want to grab Red Key. No, we can't take Red Key with us down though. Well, 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 that's why you want to grab a school bag. That's why you want school bag out of death cert because, um, what you can do is grab your R key and you can go and place this down in an entirely different room with active items in it. Um, oh no, because you know, you're being an idiot. Hold on. Stop being so freaking stupid for once in your life. Walk back. You have a school bag now. So pick this up. Um, is there anything you want here? Yes, I want this. Okay. Uh, sausage is very good. And 
Binge Eater as well is pretty nice. But I'm going to do those. I'm going to go in here. And going to Soul of Eden. Soul of Eden. Ah, yes. Two magic skins. My favorite. And we, what we can do next is Soul of Isaac. The magic skins. Soul of Isaac. Into Isaac's tomb. We'll take for sure. And I guess lost contact as well. Might as well pop this. Uh, save and exit again so you don't lose your progress here. And then... I do really want to get a Diplopia right now. Because we could then double our Arceys. But I don't know if there's a dedicated way to get Diplopia right now. Because we don't have a shop pool to pull from. Sure, we'll, we'll, we'll get real big here. Why not? Well, what are these, huh? Pagalas. I'll Yara these runes. And then... I'll do that. Our music is gone? Strange. Uh, I'll do it again. Nothing interesting happened, really. Okay. Well, I think the answer here is obvious. We can't switch to our... Oh, we gotta go all the way around, and then we get our R key. Uh, yeah. Oh, you have stairway now, too. Huh. That's pretty nice to see. Which gives us magic skin. I, You know what? You know what? It's not terrible to have. So what do I want out of this run now? I don't want to crash is the fucking issue. I don't want to crash constantly. And with our current build, we're going to be crashing a lot. So... Huh. How do we get rid of our build? We, did we save after we popped Death Cert? Yeah, definitely we did. Definitely we did. Ay, uh, ay, yeah, ay, yeah, dude. Just, just... Go to the 100 Arky. Exit game. Continue. Don't go up the stairway. It's a useless freaking item for you. Open a tomb because you have two spirit hearts. Okay. Um. Please stop crashing. That's all I ask right now. Stop with the crashes. Just let me play the game normally. Uh, we'll go to Beast this run, this lap, I guess. It's our, like, again, like, one of our 400th Arky runs of this, this series um, on the streak file. I wouldn't mind getting Genus God. <laughs> Holy shit, Isaac. I'm about to console command myself fucking the reverse stars card. Let's go ham. I, if I could do it all over again, man, I would take Genesis uh, and, and then school bag and get both Arkies. If I could do it all over again. Never skip school bag is the uh, new lesson here. Never skip school bag. Ay ay ay. Yeah, we're already max on HP. Like, just let me out of these rooms. Get in my circle. Die this way. Come near me and die. Oh, we have Isaac's heart, so we can just touch enemies, right? Yeah, yeah, we can just rush enemies down. Actually, I'm realizing now. All we gotta do is just walk into enemies and we win. Okay, six stuff. Uh, there's a lot of boss damage as well. What gives us the ability to walk into enemies and deal damage? What is that? Might as well hold magic skin and go down to the downpour here. We'll see what's going on. What is the next pool we want to farm for an item from? We haven't seen red key yet, and I really do want to get, um... Oh, I don't really want you either. I really do want to see, uh, red key on this, or, yeah, red key on this run. It's a good chance to get a, uh, a door open here, actually. On this, uh boss trap room if it's so permitting for us i don't want to shoot die thank you <laughs> the q baby is kind of like our biggest way to deal damage right now look it opened right there what's alive oh what that was strange we have two open here okay nothing this way what's this room open up into oh a vault room cool 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 all right yeah this will be a quick one if we don't crash or keep crashing at least we'll just save and quit every once in a while We'll go to Beast. We will not shoot ever again. We have broken this run to hell and back. No Ultra here, huh? Damn. Unlucky with those poles. Nope. Pick it back up. You want to have this. And just walk into shit, man. I don't know if it's a protection circle or if it's like a weird melee attack that we have. This seed is very close to our old seed as well. Ouch. It's actually the exact same. Is this Robo Baby? Oh, it's Polyphemus. Oh, that is a uh, not Robo Babby. Okay. Uh, you know, I would 
rather have Polly over Robo Baby, I will, I will admit to you. No thing here either. Actually, Red Key can appear in the uh, Red Room pool for us because it has red on it and we haven't seen it yet. So the biggest strat to get Red Key right now uh, would probably be... Oh, hello. Uh, you know what? Sure, why not? To use Crystal Key to open up the Red Room, like right here, and then go ham in there with magic scan, I guess. Oops. Walking in and walking out, huh? So what you want to do, I guess, is... um. You should, you should take that, yeah? You need the HP and the damage back. Start rolling this into potentially being what you need. Can I get a battery here off the whim? We had one. We lost it, though. I guess you can maybe take Dark Arts. Uh, actually, it doesn't do anything. Dark Arts kind of sucks now. Wait, Dark Arts is good because we don't have to shoot with it. That's actually maybe good for us. I don't know. I kind of like the, the chance to see a red key here for Ascension. And um, using the, the red key to get a bunch of air rooms into glitch items and things like that. That could be fun, man. Uh, although, it might take us a bit too long to actually farm for that. Why don't we just like go to the end? There's no need to keep trying to farm all this shit. The, the run already as it is, it's pretty scary. Pretty scary here. So just, just go on down. I gotta get rid of these goddamn harps, man. There's too many. There's too goddamn many. Candy heart. Did we already lose our entire angel pool of items? We haven't even seen godhead or sacred heart yet, have we? We saw them in death search, true, but like, I haven't seen them anywhere else yet. Strange. Strange, strange. Oh, well, I mean, it doesn't really matter. We don't need a times two damage multiplier right now. We have all that we need on our person. I mean, a polyphemus build, no matter what you're running with, is bound to help you win any run that you need. Also, save your money for a uh, stairway every floor. Because if you do find a really cool rare item in there, that, that could be your calling card, man. That could. And there's the plopia. Mm. It's not going to be that useful for us. It would be if we can get the money for it, but outside of trying to find money for it, it's not going to do anything super game-changing right now. So I say, honestly, forget about it. Forget about it. There's no need to have it. What's it going to do for you? Double one angel pool item from your red room or your, like, stairway room? I mean, is that really worth it for you? 15 cents worth? You just buy the item outright, I guess. And we'll just keep on going down. There's no need to wait on that. And stop popping magic skin. You only have four hearts. You have the waiver. We only have four hearts remaining. So don't, don't worry about that. Yeah, just go on. There's no need. Again, like seriously speaking, there is zero need to do anything on this run anymore. Just literally go to do the beast and end your run. You are a tank. You just walk into things and they all die. So why don't we just banter for a while now? What, what, did, I, what did I have for breakfast? I had cinnamon rolls, all right? I, you know those ones that come in the roll, we gotta like pop the roll open. It's like a, uh, Pillsbury Doughboy brand, I think is what, what they are. They're, uh, they're classic from where I'm from, you know, in, in my, in my family. We used to eat those like once a week. My parents would buy them for us when we were kids at the store and I hadn't had them in God knows how long. And me and Desi went to the store one day and she's like, we should get cinnamon rolls. And I'm like, oh shit, that's a really fucking good idea, Desi. And lo and behold, dude, like, like every time in the world, she's right. We don't have the feather anymore, do we? No, we lost the feather. No point in sacrificing either. Uh, and we had them, and now, like, every week, every time we go to the store every Tuesday about, and every time we go, we grab some cinnamon rolls, and it's kind of like a tradition now. I mean, they're really fucking good. Like, if you haven't had the Pillsbury Doughboy cinnamon rolls, like, you are fucking missing out, man. They're, uh, not good for you by any means, but is anything good ever good for you? Like, honest to God, name one... I guess there are foods that taste good and are good for you, but they, they don't come across every once... They, they, you know, they're very rare. It's like it's like the Black Star or the Pain Star. It only comes once every 1,000 years. Huh. Did somebody say Game Crash? Oh, did somebody say Game Crash? How would you work with C-Section, huh? What, what, what's your card? And do we still have the Feather Effect on us right now? I don't think we do. Nah, we can get a Mega Satan run going if you really want to in the end of the day here, but not really worth it. 
But I don't know. Like, we talked about breakfast food just a couple episodes ago and talked about pancakes and waffles. And a lot of you guys surprisingly said you guys were waffle fans, which I gotta... I gotta fix you guys eventually, but today is not the day to fix you. You're gonna be fine for a while. But on a breakfast, like, actual tier list, man, I think, um... I genuinely would put cinnamon rolls, like, lower than pancakes and waffles because they're more of, like, a dessert to me, in a way. They're, they're, like, they're like donuts, right? Are donuts... Okay, here's here's a question. Are donuts a breakfast food or a dessert? Or are they a breakfast dessert? Huh? You ever think about that before? I... My first time thinking about this question, I gotta say, they're both in between breakfast and dessert. They're, like, a special breakfast. You never really eat them. I only eat donuts when I'm, like, at a special occasion, usually. But the thing is, too, like, they're, all, they're not really ever just sold at just breakfast, right? They're like a, uh, uh... It doesn't matter what time of the day it is. You can eat them at any point. You go to any kind of, like, social event at, like, a church or, like, a, a rec center. Oh, we got donuts for you guys. Oh, thanks for the donuts, man. Like, they can be eaten at literally any time of the day. I think donuts are more of a... Are they, are they a snack food is the next question. Dessert, breakfast, or snack food? Where do they fall in this category? I need to know now. Pins? Thank you. I guess my final answer is that they're a dessert snack. They're eaten uh, either after a... That was dumb. After a meal? Um, or as a snack at a social event. Like an ice cream social almost. Is ice cream a dessert or a snack food? Because you can get ice cream at like, at like, you know, ice cream... Like, because kids have those ice cream socials, you know? Oh, that nice blue room here. Kids have those ice cream socials, you know? Oh, you're back. Yeah, sure, why not? Kids have, like, the, uh... Well, they'll go to, like, you know, uh, a first grade party, and they'll be like, oh, we have, you know, ice cream here. And it's not treated as a dessert. It's more treated as, like, a, an actual, um... Let me in. Ah, blue room's right. It's treated as, like, an actual, um... Like, almost like a meal at that point. I guess kids eat less overall, though. Like, I mean... A first grader is not going to eat, like, a full-ass pizza and then go to their fucking rec center and then eat, like... You know, a whole bowl of ice cream, too. It's not, you know, the most common thing in the world. I guess if I had to truly say one or the other for snack, breakfast, or dessert, I would say donuts are a snack but if i if i could go in like in a venn diagram here it would be between snack and dessert i think you're funny that's really bad as well uh, can i get a charge here please off of this angel statue no i cannot sadly damn there's our key piece back though we got two key pieces look at that uh we'll just move on then again who cares did we lose a oh we lost a regular heart we gotta find a confessional here soon man i need to get rid of these broken hearts down bad on this floor is will be nice. I, I do have uh, Polaroid still. There's no chances there. We'll just go down then. Who cares? Just be cautious, you know? Be very, very cautious. You, you could lose this run at any point still. Confessional in here? <gasps> Ooh. That's an insanely good find. Go in. You lost a uh, broken heart already. Good stuff. Oh, it already broke. No, dude. Okay. Here's what you should do. Take Book of Shadows with you. Take Book of Shadows with you. Because 4.5 Book of Shadows is like one of this world's freest win synergies ever made. The problem is now we have to be holding Magic Flash because if we don't hold Flash, we're only going to see Flash in every room we go into. So you have to hold Magic Flash right now. Which is, is, you know, not the worst thing in the world. Basically, all it did was cancel out School Bag for us. But we should be fine to win this run now because contact damage with, with um, uh, Book of Shadows does insane amount of charges for you. Think Mega Mush 4.5, uh, Mom's gone. Heal 4.5, shit it. like that. It works out very, very well. Yeah, I, if I had to put ice cream, whether it was snack or dessert, I would put ice cream in the dessert category overall, but there is an argument to be made for ice cream being a snack food. I mean, there are ice cream bars that are literally made just to be a snack food, you know? 
Ooh. Yes, please on that. I am going to shoot once, see what our tiers are like right now, because we've gotten a little bit of some crazy upgrades. All right. We now know what our tiers are like, I guess. It's, uh, it's like that. It's like that. I'm going to F12 and screenshot. Oh, I can't because the game's crashing. Right. Uh, Isaac, please close. Close program. I got to get a meaty screenshot for today's thumbnail chat. It's got to look real nice and good. But yeah, I hope you guys seem to enjoy the uh, Alexa collab as well that happened a couple days ago uh, on his channel. The Deliverance Challenge. You guys seem to enjoy that a lot. There are very many positive comments on that. I thank you guys for the, the kind words. It was a ton of fun to record, and I hope that we can do more in the future. Of course, you know, if that kind of hinges on the, on the fans liking it, and you guys seem to, so I'm sure we'll find it again at some point. Maybe even his regular-ass runs, who knows? Whatever, whatever he wants to do, man. Okay. I'm gonna buy both of these. That's very good for us. And head on up. We can maybe shoot once on, uh, on Beast? Maybe. It might crash our game. I'll, I'll try Dogma and I'll try Beast shooting. I'll try both of those. A confessional. Let's go. Clear my broken hearts, game. Clear them from me. So just one or two, please. Just one or two. Oh, two. Nice. Okay, we're taking damage now. So you buy this. You bomb this guy. And you walk in. Charge right there. Beautiful. Okay, you pop that. You walk into it again. Spawn some soul hearts. Just get rid of my... Okay, we're down to one broken heart. Beautiful. Actually insane. We're down to zero broken hearts now. Okay, I got a half heart back. Another soul heart back. A soul heart back from Gimpy right there. Maybe we can get an item out of this thing right now? I don't want to push my luck too much, but maybe we can get some, something good here. One more try. Okay, got a soul heart there. We'll give it some, one more try here. Okay, good. He's not... We're not getting hit. Why are we not getting hit playing this? We have iframes for some reason there. And we got a, a break. Okay, fine by me. Fine by me. What we can start doing now is... We could be uh, magic skidding again if we really felt like it on this run. Oh, hey. How, how you doing, buddy? How you doing? Um... We could start He's magic skinning so in uh, boss fights. Ooh, we should go for a error room on this floor if we can. We have a good setup here. All it takes is one crystal key clear right there. Okay, that was kind of a lame one because it goes to a normal room up there, but that's all right. Okay, touch, touch. All right, bad hit. Um, if we can get some kind of like whew, crystal key thing going on. Oh, homing shots, huh? Can't take you out, sadly. Um, into, like, a bunch of these cracked keys or a crawl space, too. Oh, Swallow Penny? I don't even need that anymore, dog. I hope for one to go up, maybe. That'd be a nice one to see as a, an air, a, a red room going up for us. No, 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 no. Exit game. I don't know what the hell happened there, but that was gonna be a crash, and I felt it in my freaking bones. Oh, the money stayed. Cool. I don't know what caused that to happen, but that was a lot of tears coming out. Was not a fan of that. Okay, a room opened over here that leads uh, to nowhere. All right, fine by me, I guess. Bang, bang, bang. bang. This is the highest chance we'll have to clear out a uh, floor for an error room, so might as well try our damnedest, right, chat? Might as well try our best. Nothing opened there, though, sadly. Our last chance for a good one to happen is straight down. Uh, I could go off to the left or up, I guess, too, could work for us. Depends. Okay, one opened here. One more chance. Nah, damn. I, I will try going down though. We have the chance. We have we have a good chance for one maybe. Again. Oh wait, is that our wall right? No, it's not our wall. We had to get a. Oh, we have to hold a cracked key, you dumbass. Go back, find a cracked key. Uh, there are no secret room pools here, sadly. If there were, we could pop one down for a low percent chance red key. But I don't see it happening very commonly. We'll just continue to look on down and maybe get some lucky cracked key opens or, or, you know, crystal key opens and stuff like that. There is a room that could, you know, give us some good stuff here. Nothing. Okay, this is our last chance for an error room on this run. If we don't get one, you know what, dude, so be it. We're going on an hour and a half on this run right now, but you, these, these longer runs tend to do better than the shorter runs anyways, so... This is your compensation for the 10-minute run we had last week, or la a couple days ago. Please open it up. 
Eels. Straight eels there. Okay. Well, you know, BD1P, you tried your damnedest. Just, just go on. You know where your room is. Walk over to it and move the hell on. Where is it, actually? Is it over here? Hey, you're right here. Okay, cool. Okay. I would say uh, you're going to win the run, and I believe that right now truly, but anything can go wrong at any moment here. So just make sure you're still being wary. Things can go haywire. You can get an error room here. Game? Game, what are you, what are you doing? Okay, it's final. the chain finally stopped there, but we're getting awfully close. What does this do in a, a red room? Uh, just a regular item? Okay, that's fine. We now have uh, another Broken Hearts. We can get maybe a Confessional. Play that for some uh, extra uh, gains. Nothing great there. Pills, though, could be. Tears up. Nice. And another one makes you larger, huh? We're getting large in this. We have some pretty some pretty big stature on this run right now. Please don't shoot, though, at any time. Yeah, I don't know what happens. Like, occasionally we will shoot. I don't know what's shooting for us, but it is making me really nervous for this run right now. I'm extremely nervous. Oh, hey, Cricket's Head. No, nice to see you here, man. Uh, 18 damage up. Cool. Uh, that's pretty average, I would say, for a damage up right there. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. Continue on. Maybe some nice red room opens here. Some some extra beggars or IV machines. Anything positive like that. You never know, man. You never know. Can we pop magic skin on the beast fight and get a random free-ass item? That would be pretty fun to see. I would take... Okay. One like, active item I would take over... Um, Book of Shadows right now, amazing. Uh, Book of Shadows right now would be Mom's Bracelet. For the one re this This game is so loud, holy shit. For the one reason that um, with the new patch, we can now pick up Cube Baby uh, with Mom's Bracelet. I know, I know it's insane, I get it. We could do it though. Uh, I don't want to really see Poke, friend. I'll buy a Soul Heart and leave, I guess. All right. This should be our last floor up here. Mm. My bad. Uh, two more floors. This one and the next one. Then we'll be good. We could, again, get lucky with our, our crystal key and get an air room on this floor, too. It's never out of the question. I mean, we, we can get an air room with only zero cracked keys. If, if, if uh, crystal key wants to proc enough for us. Low chance, but you never know, man. It could happen. And you are small rock? You are not. You are just soul hearts. Whatever. It's still fine. We already were in there. All right, continue on, man. Continue on. I would say this run from being, like, in the chest, we were, we were going pretty, you know, low on our, um... Huh. That's interesting. You know what? Why not? We'll go this way. See what happens, right? No rooms opened up. Damn. I'll play you. I'll play you. Get an extra charge on this. Maybe a battery item wouldn't be too bad for us. I'm looking for a confessional, though, and, like, extra charges for our Book of Shadows right now. The only way we're going to win this run realistically without, like, you know, throwing all of our Isaac's heart HP away is, is first of all, crashing. And second of all, ooh, ooh, I like that. That's a very fun item for us. Can't even afford that, damn. I'll take butter. Why not, man? Uh, is if we use Book of Shadows to get a lot of charges on the final floor of the game, that is kind of our biggest win condition. Where are you going? Oh, a golden uh, trinket as well. Not bad at all. Last item room is going to be swarm. Yeah, it's good. And pop your pills. You have only good uh, good pills because you have um what's it? Only tears up pills. Also, we know now that our red our red and white pill was a I'm drowsy that crashed our game. We only have good pills in our rotation right now because we do have um luckfoot so. You never know. These could all be good. We have, we are a large man, too, I realize right now. We are very big. You can count all the pixels on my face right now. That's crazy. That is very crazy. All right. Money is good for stairway, I guess. The end of your run is coming up shortly. Well, I will say, you, if you're watching this far into the video, you're going to be here for our final fight, I guarantee it. But remember to just, if you enjoy the video enough and you want to support me as a creator and as a channel, make sure you're liking... Oh, we dropped... Wafer on the ground. Oh, Butter can drop passives. Do we have any game break? We could drop one of our crashing passives on the ground, I guess. But if, if you enjoy my channel and my videos, a like and a comment does help. And it goes a really long way uh, for me as a creator. Like, commenting on a video boosts that shit so far in the algorithm. It's, it's insane. So if you want to leave a nice comment or helpful comment or some kind of critique, whatever you want to leave, 
it helps me out no matter what it is, negative or positive. Same with liking the video and stuff like that. It does help me out quite a bit. Uh, I do want to get my um my thing back. I want my my yeah yeah yeah, yeah. give me that. That's a good setup right here. Please air me on this floor. I'd love that. Nah, not gonna happen. We're out of options, boys. We're out of options. But um, they they all go a long way. As long as if you're not just subbed to the channel, uh, I'd appreciate it if you were. It it helped. The number is is arbitrary to you guys, but it does mean a lot to me. Uh, we had a recent really big kick in subs thanks to Alexa and my collab. So, shout out Tyler for that one. Or I guess I should just call him Alexa. I don't know if we're on a first name basis yet, guys. I'm not sure. Nah, it, we're fine, but. Nah, the run's over. The run's over at this point. Who cares? But yeah, just the support just helped me a lot, and it makes me, as, as a creator, you know, helps me grow and, and make my content a little bit better. That is interesting right there. Very interesting. Uh, There's no real point in taking it, though, right now. Really, there isn't any point. We will simply just clear our last room. There's nothing, and we'll move on up. We will try shooting once on Dogma. If we crash the game, we're not shooting at all. We'll just walk into the TV and finish it that way, I guess. Normal. Nothing in there. If we get red key right now, can you imagine? Wow. All right. Pick up that. What is skin drop in here? Regular items, it looks like. We could 4.5 magic skin farm for stuff, but that is, is super, super lame, in my opinion. We will just sleep in the bed. We'll save and quit on floor 13A. And then we will try to shoot in this fight just, just once. It makes me nervous. It truly does. Although things are happening that look to be pretty good for us, I guess. The shots, they find... Okay, we, we actually did that. Now, we do a lot more damage contact-wise, I think. We'll shoot one more time here. We miss all of our shots, it looks like there. Interesting. Get him. Sick him. We How are we missing all of our shots right now? What is going on? Block your Isaac's heart. Block your Isaac's heart. Thank you. Okay, keep keep safe. Remember, this is the hardest, you know, part of the run. Okay. No. What did we lose there? What item did we drop? I don't even know what it was. I don't even care anymore, honestly. Okay. Uh, let's save and quit on the beast fight. Does it put us in the beast fight? It does. Okay, cool. Will we crash? I don't know. Just walk into him. You... Oh, shit. Uh, we gotta maybe drop butter to make the synergy work for us a little bit better. We'll drop butter. Who needs butter right now, right? Uh, you hurt me. Okay, pop that again. Get a charge back off if you possibly can. Just stay. If you stay on top of the enemies, they cannot do shit to you. You have this build in the back. So if you enjoyed this run, you want to see more, again, like, comment, sub for the algorithm. It helps me out more than you know. Um, aside from that, all of my stuff is down below. Twitch, Twitter, and Discord. Join our Discord. We have a great community in Discord. It's a, a wild and fun one. You guys are a little bit crazy. You know, kooky in there sometimes. You know, quirky, if you will. But yeah. Thank you guys again for all the support recently on this channel. It's been crazy seeing my growth. And I, I plan to keep going further and further with it. So, you know, thank you guys for making this possible for me. It does mean a lot. But anyways, it's going to be our beast fight on our, our, our like, fucking 800th Arky run of this series. You're going to die ever? Ever you're going to die? There we go. Now you're perished. All right. Last horseman here. Ooh, nice card to find. We'll pop that right now, actually. Get a charge in our Book of Shadows. Pop that, I guess. And get even more charges back off. Can we kill death here in one cycle, do you think? We did. All right. Beast kind of worries me here. Because if we shoot at all, we crash. And I want to keep my Isaac's heart as far back as possible. So I'm going to do it. I was going to stand right here. We should be fine. Just get inside a beast right here. Put some bombs down. Keep charging back up. You should win this free. Keep managing your active and your bombs. Okay. We're not doing that much damage. Reason okay, now no, we are. Our contact damage is a bit insane. Get behind him. Okay, yeah, you are you are doing a lot of damage here. Well, 
if you enjoyed, you know, everything I just said before. But aside from that, guys, I have been BD1P. Peace out. And goodbye.